everyone has enormous respect for the Wildlife Without Borders program. Uh, by training and empowering uh, a younger generation of conservationists across Latin America and the Caribbean, it's made a tremendous contribution uh, to those regions uh, which are important to the people there and to the biodiversity of the whole world. In 2008 alone, more than 14 countries across the region, Latin America and the Caribbean, were helped by Wildlife Without Borders. Wildlife Without Borders has helped us in many, many different ways. But one of the most uh, important ones throughout time is in, in training professionals. I cannot uh, conceive any effort in, in building capacity in a country where we don't focus on our richest resource, which is the human resource. Wildlife Without Borders leverages money so effectively. So there are some places where you can see eight times the investment returned. Just in the last eight or nine years, well over 2,000 wildlife conservationists, uh, principally in the Caribbean and Latin America, have benefited uh, from training directly as a result of this partnership. The Association of Zoos and Aquariums and all its member institutions are thrilled to be working with the Fish and Wildlife Service. There's not another organization anywhere in the world with greater expertise, greater resources, and a greater record of success in its commitment to wildlife conservation.